Hello, I'm Kippur, and I'm a space nurse. Hello, I'm Sally Poor. I'm Kim and myself put together spaces for the producers of the Nova Space Gallery. Hi, I'm Jim Sardin, and this is Space Space Fest 2012. It's great to be here. Excellent. Who's Thank your favorite you. astronaut? I've got a lot of friends that are astronauts. They're all my friends. They're all my friends. Hi, I'm Mike Blaine, and I'm at Space Fest. You should be here too. <laughs> I'm Andrew Chaikin. I'm the author of A Man on the Moon, A Passion for Mars, and other books about space exploration. And Kim and Sally are my dear friends. And if Space Fest is happening, I'm always there. So, happy Space Fest number four. I'm Alan Gould, and I'm from the University of California, Berkeley. I'm with the NASA Kepler mission, and I'm here, right here at Space Fest. In, uh, in Tucson, Arizona. I'm Mark Millis, and the shortest explanation for what I do is I'm a genuine rocket scientist, and I'm here to talk about progress towards visions like the Starship Enterprise. I'm Seth Jostak, an astronomer at the SETI Institute, and I'm here at fabulous Space Fest. I'm Phil Plate. I'm an astronomer from Boulder, Colorado, and I write the Bad Astronomy blog for Discover Magazine, and I'm at Space Fest 4 in Tucson, Arizona. Good evening. I'm Jeff Notkin, host of Meteorite Men, the television series on Science Channel. I'm also a science writer, meteorite specialist, and a space program fan, and there's nowhere in the world that I would rather be right now than at Space Fest, Arizona. I'm Richard Hatch, actor Richard Hatch, not the survivor guy. Uh, I'm Battlestar Galactica, but both old and new, and I am here at Space Fest, and I have been at the last four. This is one of the most amazing shows to be able to hang out with the astronauts, with the test pilots, with the civilian and military space programs, and find out where we're going to go in the next 20, 50, 100 years is the most amazing experience of my life. I'm so happy to be here. My name's Peter Smith. I'm at F Space Fest every year. I'm a, a scientist and I study Mars and I just love the interaction with artists and uh, collectors, astronauts. I think it's a fabulous situation. I, I come every year. Hi, my name's Michelle Rauch. I am at Space Fest and go see it because it's the best. I am really glad to be at Space Fest. I'm uh, Dan Durda. I'm at uh, Southwest Research Institute in Boulder, Colorado. But uh, I'm part-timing as a space artist. I'll be talking uh, about asteroids on an asteroid panel and uh, giving a little tour about our plans for Southwest Research Institute getting ready to fly into space with XQ Aerospace and Virgin Galactic. So it's going to be a busy couple days and really enjoying it. I'm Bobby Hancock, and I'm at Space Fest. How do? Welcome to Space Fest. I'm uh, John Spencer from the Southwest Research Institute in, in Boulder, Colorado, and here I am at Space Fest. I'm Rob, I'm at Space Fest, and I said
tell the on-site photos for the astronauts inside. I'm Francis. I'm really happy to be here at Space Fest for my third stop. Um, this is the most amazing show I get to go to, and it's such a beautiful location too. I love being here, and it's a lot of fun. Well, I'm Kirk McCoy, and I'm at Space Fest here in Tucson. The photographer here, photographer, is way too complicated. Hi, my name is Mel Croft, and I will be an astronaut. I'm Dean with Starzona, and uh, we're here at Space Fest today showing off our equipment we manufacture. It's called the Hyperstar Lens. It converts a typical uh, Schmidt Casperian telescope into an F2 imaging system, making it 25 times faster, and delivering a star image 10 times better than the scope produces natively. And so amateurs can take uh, amazing deep sky images in minutes instead of hours. So hi, I'm Robert Brand and uh, I'm here from Australia and I'll be talking about both what Australia has done so far with space and deep space tracking and then what I'm doing with it and uh, I've actually had a history, I go back as far as Apollo 11 and wired up a lot of the uh, comms back in Australia for that and most of the space missions up to Challenger uh, but now we're actually helping to put rockets up, we're trying to get some into orbit, payloads into orbit, we're uh, building a deep space network, a global one uh, and uh, we're actually going to do a TV show with kids and it's focused on space. A lot happening. I don't have many hours left in the day but I'm enjoying Space Fest. It's great. Lots of great people here. Lots of great art here as well. So uh, I'm really having a lot of fun. And I'm going out to visit some of the, uh, what was it, the museum, the air aircraft museum and the uh, silo, missile silos down south. Great time, great place. Hi, I'm Lisa White. I'm the Framer. And I'm at Space Fest? Yeah! <laughs> Hello, my name's Earl Sperber. This is my fourth Space Fest. I've been at every one of them. And uh, anyway, I'm just a space nut. <laughs> My name is Scott Sacknoff, uh, Quest History Space Flight, and I am at Space Fest. Hey, my name is Libby Eggleson. I'm here with Jeff Notkin and Suzanne Morrison with the Aerolite crew, and we're selling meteorites, and we're having a great time here at Space Fest. I'm Lucy West. And I'm a space artist, and um, I'm at Space Fest for, and um, I have to give credit to Alan Bean for inspiring me to become a space artist. And so it's been a real treat to be here exhibiting in the show, same show with uh, Alan Bean and meet my hero. Yeah, and I loved it. Hello, my name is Calvin Seaman. I'm from Houston, Texas. I work with the NASA Johnson Space Center. This is my first opportunity to come to the Space Fest here in Tucson, and it's been a terrific experience. Hey, good morning. I'm Wally Beck. I'm here at Space Fest 4. It's a wonderful time run by great people, and the best part of it all is you get to meet astronauts. And that's why I'm here, because it's our time to meet our astronauts and uh, pay back for all the things that they've done for us and to get some autographs and see some great paintings. So come on by to Space Fest next time it's on door. Well, I'm Sean Brock, but I'm a pilot for a volunteer. I fly corporate aircraft. I found out about this uh, last year and didn't have time to go for work for what I intended to do it this year, and I did. So I came as a universal guest. And it's, uh, it's overwhelming. It's, uh, it's sensory overload at first, and you have to pretty much pick out what you want to do. But it seems like it, uh, this is amazing. Needless to say, we'll be here next year.
Well, good morning. My name's Colin Burgess. I've travelled to Space Fest 4 from Sydney, Australia. Uh, I come here representing myself as the series editor of the Outward Odyssey series of books, uh, both as an author and uh, an editor. And uh, I'll be doing guest speaking here and also introducing some of my authors in my uh, writing stable. And uh, also to do some interviewing for future book projects. So it's an exciting place to be, it's uh, an exciting lot of people to meet, and uh, renewing a lot of friendships along the way. So it's a very worthwhile thing to do and a fun thing to do. Uh, my name's Alina, I work for Kim, and I do the shipping and packing, and I run the Nova Space booth. And where are you? And I'm at Space Fest. <laughs> I'm Mike Carroll. I'm a, an astronomical artist and a science writer. And uh, I'm here at Space Fest because it's a gathering of uh, amazing people. It's a historic event. Um, the astronauts uh, and the scientists here uh, provide just an amazing opportunity to, uh, for somebody like me who paints the new frontier but also who writes about it. Uh, it's just a golden opportunity to talk to these really special people. Uh, the artists are phenomenal. The art show is just beautiful and I am always humbled to uh, you know, be in the company of these, these really talented people. So uh, okay. it's a great place to okay, come. Cool. Okay, I'm Leonard David. I'm a space writer journalist. I write for Space.com and Space News newspaper and stuff. And I was invited here to uh, participate, and uh, it's my second time here, so it's kind of fun. I'm still trying to figure out the... It seems like a collision of a lot of different things coming together here. I'm trying to sort it out. Pictures and autograph seekers and former astronauts or wannabe astronauts, so it's all kind of fun. So it's, uh, yeah, it's, uh, yeah, and then they have the speakers. I'll be giving a talk a little bit later on. Uh, what I think are themes coming up in the next uh, decade or so. So, uh, yeah, it's a very interesting, eclectic group of people. Very eclectic. I don't know how you define eclectic, but it's eclectic. <laughs>